Dear Mrs. Rajavi, and dear friends, of course, as a Maltese member of the European Parliament, I understand the struggle for democracy. Decades ago, um, the Maltese people only experienced the rule of law in speeches, but of course not in practice. And today, after all these years, Malta enjoys its status as a full member of the European Union. And even now, after all these years, members of the European Union, we must continue to strive to uphold the rule of law. Because democracy is not something you obtain once and then forget about. We must live it, we must protect it every day. And this is why we understand what the Iranian people are going through. We understand your wish for a better life, where your rights are protected, where the rule of law works and institutions function. And where institutions protect innocent citizens and not a regime, a regime that has taken hold of a country and its people, a regime involved in human rights abuses, torture, unfair trials and illegal detention. The European Parliament does not ignore human rights abuses that take place outside its borders. We are serious about our values and so we cannot ignore those who inspire us with their struggle. I will continue, of course, to advocate um, for, for the human rights for all Iranians, not least those that are on the, on the front line those doing what they can to better the nation and work for peace and justice. And I will continue to support you in any way that I can. I thank you for your courage and determination, and I hope that your, uh, your efforts may eventually lead to a free Iran. Good luck and thank you.